Today I'm going to talk to you about telehealth, about how to set up for a successful visit and what can happen in that visit. Set up for a visit is key to success. Checking that your light source means that you can be seen in your camera. If you have light directly behind you, you'll be very hard for your key worker to see, which could affect how effective your session could run. Checking that you have enough batteries on your devices and a backup if anything goes wrong and picking a space where you think you might be the least interrupted. Having a microphone and speakers is often helpful and setting a stand up or anything with the activity that you have planned to do in, this, in the visit with your key worker. So what happens actually in the visit? Your key worker will start off by checking with you a few things about privacy. They'll ask who else is in the room with you. They'll also ask whether uh, that you do not record the session. And they'll ask that you don't talk about anything too sensitive or identifying in the session as well. Based on the plan that you made the previous time you saw your key worker, you will go through and set your agenda and set what you would like to do. And then you'll start work. And in that work, There'll be times when you'll be working with your key worker and your child. And there'll be times when your key worker might be just working with you. And so that your child does not need to attend during this time. And this means that we don't expect your child to sit there in front of a screen for your whole visit, because that can be tiring. At the end of your visit, your key worker will ask you a few questions around how, how it went, what you feel that you would like to do different for next time. They might make a plan with you about what next time will look like, what you might want to work on between now and seeing your key worker the next time. And then they'll set a time and a date that suits you for your next visit. Once that has been done, they'll finish off writing their notes that they've been writing throughout the record which is called a record of visit, and they'll leave that record of visit with you. They'll email it to you or take a picture and send it to you. And so that way you will know what the plan is between visits and when your next visit is. We look forward to working with you. Thank you.